Welcome to my channel, Planet with Maserati. I'm going to be doing, in scripture writing by Honey, I'm going to be doing an updated video of this beautiful uh, Bible study planner that I've been using. It is the Webster's Pages, and I'm actually loving it. So let's begin. Or before we begin, let me say welcome. I got excited there. Welcome. Please subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So, yeah. So, this is what I'm using included with this. In here, I'm not going to do, like, a complete, you know, inside what's in here because it's more about this. Is I just carry the pens and I finally got my black one back. Love it. And I carry pens. I carry, uh... The write on removable tabs, some sticky notes, some stickers, just all kinds of stuff that's going to be retaining to retaining, pertaining to faith related. And my sticker is coming apart here. So let me move that out of the way. And that's the piece that came off. Okay, and then like I have. A faith one, the black and white one, and then praise him. So I just thought these were super cute to put in here and have ready to go. So basically these are just stickers and things that I'm going to be using. I even have in here my Our Daily Bread for March, April, and May. Um, I have in here... The Poetic Book, it's by Our Daily Bread. There should be another book in here, I think. Did I not put Easter in here? Because normally I put that book in here too. No, so that's basically it. Just a lot of different little things in here. I'll do another flip of this later on. And I got this free at the, um, well I paid for a $4 uh, grab bag box. This was included, so I've been using it. Um, okay, so let's begin. Even though these two don't match, I still use it. And I know this doesn't match this, but I just think it's the cutest little pom-poms. So I just leave it on there. It's not attached to the whole planner. It's just attached to the inside. Which is moving. Okay, there we go. This here is the only thing I have in this pocket. And I've showed you that pocket. And I just hole-punched corner rounded some cards these are actually the paper pads the 12 by 12 these are the leftovers and I use them in my journal or in here which you will see so here's one of them that I use I'm just using this just to protect you know the stuff this I don't know what I'll use it for but I did put this in there as well I did use all the cards that were on top so now I just have the Versus the monthly memory, I put some extra, you know, very busy agenda 52. So they have extras of them, and I go ahead and I slice them with the hole punch. I hole punch it and then put the scissors and slice them. That way, I do not have to open my rings. I am rough with that. Here, I just have a bullet journal key. So the little circle is task, a little square is event, a dot is note, important is the asterisk, migrate is the arrow. To buy, payday, and bills is the money sign. Scripture and Bible study is the plus sign, or the cross sign. And then a heart is journal and journaling. So as you can see, this was the first month for April. I went ahead and did the scriptures that I am doing. So I already got day one and day two done i gotta do day three and day four today and that's it for that and then this is may i have not touched so let's get into the newer stuff of what i put in here so i put this this is the glam girl i did have to cut her little shoes off so i just like that part where the bow it looks like a little head with a bow but it's not it's high heels i had to cut that off that's the only part i had to cut and the where the hole punches were for the happy planner. And you can stick these in here and do little lists and stuff. So that is one of them. Okay, so that is just 
I've showed you this. This is just the weekly. Have not touched it. So I did add the tabs, which is my first tab of scripture. So as you know, I was doing the April, the grace of God. And in here, I did day one, 2 Corinthians 12, 9 through 10. I put verse 9 and 10. Verses to follow. So when you go into your app, and I showed this in the previous video when I was doing another video. Um, when you go into the app, there's these little three dots. If you click on the three dots, it'll give you a verse that's coinciding with the verses up here. So that's why I put V9, 2 Corinthians 11.30. And it says, dig deeper into... Dig deeper into the scripture. So that's that. And then green is where I know I went deeper in. This is just all black. That's just the regular scripture. The green is to let me know I was digging deeper. Same with here. So verse 9, verse 10, verse 10, verse 10. And then here is more I can go looking up. I did put the definition. So I did same thing to day 2. As you can see. Oh wait, this is backwards somehow. Wait, what is this day for? Yes, somehow I got this backwards, but yeah. This doesn't go on here. Where's day two at? I haven't figured out where I put the paper. There's a piece of paper missing. Here it is. This is what I'm looking for. That was scary. I'm like, what? where's day two at? So there is day two. There you go. And then I'm starting day three. Now that makes more sense. Back here I have, um, not yet, the kindness and goodness to do scripture writing. Or you could just pick a day if you feel like you need kindness or goodness. Freedom. So I just leave that into the scripture. Do not fear. And again, I can just take them out at any time, move them around. I don't have to open my rings. I love that concept. So it's like the Happy Planner. It's just ring bound and you don't have to worry about taking the rings, opening the rings and then damaging it. So this is for Bible study. So I just put a card there. Again, these are the cards that I was talking about that I used. Here I have the books of the Bible. From the Old Testament to the New. So every time I read the Bible and I'm done with the the you know the book, I will mark it off. There's a little squares on this side to mark off. Uh 100 promises from God's word. I don't know if I showed you this one. I probably did. And it opens up like that. Or you could open it up like that. So either way you go, you can open it up either way. So that's 100 promises from God's word. This is 25 ways to love yourself God's way. And then I already showed you this one. The genres. 102 ideas for a character Bible study. So Jesus Christ and things like that. And then it goes all the way to 54. And then Women of the Bible go all the way to 42. Oh no, sorry, 48. And then how to study the Bible using the idea method. So identification, what's going on in the passage, direction. What truth is the passage directing us to see? Encouragement, what is the passage, what is this passage encouraging us to do? An application, how can we apply the truth and wisdom in this passage. So that's all I did to there. This is just extra. 
So now we get into the the big one. So the fruit of the spirit versus. Yes, I have it twice. I just wanted a little card. Just a little cute card here. And I did tab it out. So a lot of these you're going to see are tabbed out. Scripture. So now you're going to see top tabs. Okay, so there's this one. The fruits of the spirit. And then this first tab is love. And there's the top tab for love. And it is in order for the way the fruits of the spirit is. So I wrote love, the noun, and then the verse. This is the printable that you've seen, which is going to be next. And I just put it on this side so I can start my scripture on this side. So everybody's asking, like, where did I get these inserts and stuff from? I go and type in Fruits of the Spirit. Somebody will come up. And if I like the way it looks, I will, you know, print it or screenshot it. Well, this one's by Alyssa Sawyer, WordPress.com. So all the ones you're going to see here are from her. Well, this one is. I shouldn't say all because there is another one. So here's for love. And then here's another one. Blossom in faith. So now the rest of them you will see blossom in faith. And I just use the sticker on top and that's it. I keep it basic. Joy. And again, the noun. The verse. Joy's on top. Here was love, here's joy, and then it'll keep going until the end. So here is the joy one. And again, blossominfaith.com. That's it for that one. I kind of try to leave like two papers for each one. And here is peace. I haven't put the noun or anything yet. I will do that later. Again, top tab. Put this one here. Here is peace. Again, by Blossom Faith. And got an extra piece of paper. Patience, the same thing. I got to fill that out. I have the top tab already. This one, I kind of made a mistake. It was supposed to be on this side, and this was supposed to be on the back side. Only because the coffee cup is backwards. So if I would have actually did it the correct way, my coffee cup would have been backwards. But that's okay. I hole punched it wrong. But that's just trial and error. Patience. And again, blossom in faith. Kindness. Again, I have to do that. And it went back to the front. Top tab over here instead of on the other side because that's how it's, you know, lining up. Kindness. I haven't wrote anything yet for kindness. Goodness. Same thing with that. Uh, faithfulness. I haven't did anything here, there yet. Anyway, I forgot to fold that in. Um, faithfulness. God's faithfulness. Trusting in God's faithfulness. A trustworthy person. Uh, unshakable faith. And then I just left a blank one. Gentleness. Again, I still got to put the noun and stuff for that. There's the scripture writing for it. Self-control. Same thing. And then I just left paper to do like the scripture and stuff for it. So this one I'm not going to show you, but it is the mailing list for subs. So that's my mailing list for subscribers. I'm not going to show you it because that's private. And the person that asked me is in it as well. Um, so yeah, there's more paper, just in case I need more for that. Again, you've seen the folder and you've seen this. I haven't did anything in here yet. But I've been so busy doing, let me go back to the fruits and spirit. I love when you have the tabs and you can just go straight to what you need. I love doing this. This was so much fun. Again, I will find where I got these from. All you need to do is go on Pinterest, which is the easiest thing. Go on Pinterest and look up Fruit of the Spirit verses. This will pop up. This stuff will pop up. This is included in this pack. So this is like the top one, second, and then so on. 
So those will pop up. Um, if you type in love, uh, scripture writing, she will pop up. If you type in joy, peace, anything, kindness, they will pop up. In here, I'm going to be doing more of a Bible study for this section, which I have here, Bible study. So every time I do a Bible study, I'll put it in here. I need to make a section only for when I'm reading my books. So I'm thinking either the back of here. I want to show people's information. The back of here or maybe before before the mailing list maybe here but yeah so this is my video please give it a big thumbs up leave a comment share the video that'd be greatly appreciated as always thank you for watching i know i'm showing this like a lot but i just wanted to show you what i'm doing with it and how i apply it and how i'm using it so I hope you enjoy these videos again, and I will talk to you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye.